quick tutorial to go over how to delete a property in Google Analytics 4. I'm sure we've all been there, you know, we're doing something, we're working on a project and we accidentally create an additional property that we didn't mean to. And the good news is that it is a super easy process to go ahead and start the deletion process. So what you wanna do is you wanna open up the property that you are about to destroy. Uh, in this situation, I just made a property called tutorial property. And you wanna make sure that you are gonna be deleting the property and not the account in Google Analytics. So I'm gonna show you how to do that so you don't accidentally delete your entire account. So let's navigate down to the gear icon in the bottom left. And once we click on that, make sure that we are working within the property column and not the account column, like I was talking about. So let's focus on the tutorial property under the property column. Let's go into property settings. And from here, all you have to do is click on move to trash can. And once, uh, you know, you'll have a notice once you click on that, um, you know, it, it will be scheduled for deletion. Uh, you know, there's a period where you will be able to restore that property. But, you know, if you're moving it to the trash can, you probably have intentions to delete it. So once you've read this notice and kind of taken uh, all that information in, go ahead and click on move to trash. And now that property has been moved to trash. And now, uh, you know, if I look under my account, it's no longer there. So like I said, guys, super quick and easy fix. If you ever accidentally create a property, you know, it's happened to me on more than one occasions. Uh, so yeah, um, check out our, our other Google Analytics for tutorials to help you master this platform a little bit better. Thank you for watching.